Okay, let's try this algebra question here. And this is like a factoring question, you know? What you're doing is, you see that 2 to the plus 2 there? It's really 2 squared. There's really a 4 there, 4 times 2 to the x. This is 2 to the 2x, and you split it up and make it 2 to the x times 2 to the x. There it is. It's like a FOIL thing. Those two things multiply to equal that. And then you've got to get 32, so you go minus 8 plus 4. That equals 32. And you've got minus 8 times 2 to the x, and 2 to the x times 4, they combine to equal that 4 times 2 to the x. So that's it. 2 to the x minus 8 equals 0. 2 to the minus x equals minus 4. Uh, when you subtract, there's no solution to that. You can't get a negative number. So it's just add 8, you get 2 cubed, x must equal 3. Now over here, we've got a third equation. We add x, square both sides. That's really 4 minus 2x. When you square a square root, you get 4 minus 2x. The square root goes away. There is x squared plus 4x plus 4. We're just going to add 2x, take away 4, factor it, 0 and minus 6. But we better test 0 and minus 6. And minus 6 doesn't work. It won't work. But if you put 0 into the formula, it makes it true. Therefore, x equals 0 is the answer.